City University has found a way around a law that critics say punishes kids whose parents brought them into the U.S. illegally. 41 Action News reporter Brenda Lee Gonzalez live in studio now. And Brenda Lee, this could be a way for immigrant students to get a high level education. That's right, for anyone with deferred action of childhood arrival. So that's a special two year permit for people who came to the U.S. before turning 16. Many DACA students have lived in the U.S. the majority of their lives, but now a new Missouri law forces them to pay the international student college rate nearly three times more than the in state cost they would have paid. But there's good news for students who want to go to UMKC. A spokesperson for the university says they've created a scholarship specifically for DACA students. The scholarship covers the tuition increase with private funds, not taxpayer dollars. However, the university only has funding to cover the end of the year, but they're looking for private funders to help with the rest of the semesters. Missouri Representative Scott Fitzpatrick, who sponsored the bill to require DACA students to pay a higher tuition, isn't against universities using private funds to help students, but doesn't think any tax dollars should be used. I know it's not a, a huge number of people, but at the, at the end of the day, I think that you know, if the more attractive we make it to come here or remain here uh, illegally, the worse the problem uh, of legal immigration is going to get. Around 34 students are expected to attend UMKC this summer who are eligible for the scholarship. Live in the studio, Renalise Gonzalez, 41 Action News.